So, in case you didn't know, uh, this, this right here, yeah, this is my face. And today, I just feel like I need to take a minute to just get something out into the world. Just let me rant, okay? I am so unbelievably sick of seeing people on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever it may be, someone posts a photo of themselves and people make these types of comments. Oh my god, you're pretty but your nose is way too big. Your eyes are way too close together. Your ears look like Dumbo. Your skin is way too dark. Focus on the positive. Do you think that person really wants to hear that about themselves? Do you think that they don't freaking know? Do you think they don't know? Because they probably do and they've probably heard it very many times in their life and they definitely don't need to be pushed over the edge by you on Instagram. Okay? If you're gonna say something mean about someone, at least have it be constructive, whereas the person can actually do something about what you're complaining about. <coughs> Tell them, Cookie. Tell them. I just can't with these people anymore, you guys. It's, it's not okay. Like, for instance, if someone tells me, oh, like, you're pretty, but you, your nose is too big, what do you want? me to do about this? Do you want me to go get a nose job just so when you spend the 0.5 seconds scrolling through your Instagram feed and you see my face, my nose is to your liking? My nose is like the proper ratio to my face for your liking? Is that what you're wanting when you leave those comments? I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't really get that many comments saying that people think something's wrong with my face. Maybe like, oh, you have a pimple or uh, maybe, yeah, like your nose is a little big, whatever. Doesn't really bother me at this point, but what really bothers me more is that these young kids who aren't quite that strong with confidence yet are facing this and it's not okay and it needs to stop. I just feel like society is becoming more and more intense, more people feel like they need plastic surgery to be accepted, to feel beautiful, to be confident, and it's like, yeah, if you want to do that, do you, but I think that's really unfortunate that that is how people are feeling. Maybe I'm living in a dream world here, people, but I don't understand why we have to be so mean to each other. All I'm saying is, before you leave a comment like that on someone's photo, video, whatever, just really put yourself in that person's shoes. And also take a step back, do you think you're really perfect? Really? Like you think there's nothing wrong with you, so you're like so high up there that you can look down and say, hey, your nose is too big? I don't know if I'm crazy, I'm just imagining things, but I really feel like it has just gotten worse and worse and worse and worse. With the whole digital age and social media and all of this, I cannot imagine you guys out there who are young right now going through this. Like the selfie generation of putting yourself out there and having people say terrible things about you. I cannot imagine what that must feel like and my heart goes out to you. I think you're beautiful. I'm the kind of person I genuinely 100%, I'm not being fake when I say this, I think that everyone is beautiful in their own way. There is no like image of beauty and if you don't fit that image you're not beautiful. That is the biggest brainwashing that our society has ever received and it's so uncool. I just remember the first time someone told me that I had a big nose. I can tell you right now, I had never once in my entire life really thought about the fact that my nose was big or that my nose was out of the ordinary. And even to this day, I mean, maybe, yeah, it's not perfect, it's not teeny tiny like a model's, but it's my nose. It's my nose that looks just like my dad's nose. And I think that's really nice and I think that's special. And I, to be completely real with you guys, I have had moments where I've considered plastic surgery. Like really considered. Because I do, with what I do, feel a lot of pressure to be perfect. You know, and it would, on some level, probably make my life a little bit easier if I did have the perfect nose and like slightly bigger boobs. You know, it would probably make me feel better, but I, 
at the same time, I, I feel like I would be disappointed in myself for giving in to the demands of society. I know that some people, that's just genuinely what they want and like, good for you, nothing against that. But for me, I just don't think, I don't think I can do that. I don't think I'll ever be able to do that. Unless I end up having like five kids and my boobs just turn to nothing and I just, I just really need them back. I don't know, I just felt like talking about this. This is a video that I've wanted to, to do for a while and just never got around to doing and I just woke up today, literally got no sleep last night, probably like two hours. Woke up, got ready and I was just like, I'm gonna shoot this video today. Here I am. I also think something that's really important to remember is everyone, even the person that you think is the most beautiful person in the world, they have insecurities just like you. I have definitely had very dark days of insecurity. I've had bad skin my entire life, genetic, tried everything to fix it. Uh, right now is actually the best that it's ever been, but I still have spots, you know, and it's been really hard for me to come to terms with that, that that is just my face. This is the, the hand I was dealt. This is my face and I need to embrace it and I need to quit stressing about things that I can't really control because it's not going to do any good for me. Um, and over the years I have, I have gotten really confident with my reflection, but it's been a journey and it's taken time. And it definitely doesn't help when people comment mean things on Instagram or whatever that I can't change about myself unless I pay someone to slice my face open, which I'm not going to. <laughs> okay, so this video is uh, quite all over the place, but I think you get the point. I think you get the message. Stop saying these things about people and making them feel like they're not good enough. This is my fucking face. You guys have your face. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, I'm gonna go. I love you all so much, and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Bye.